I'm Daniel Goldman, co-owner and industrial designer here at MSB Technology. Today, I'd like to take some time to share some insights into the Digital Director. Why we made it, how it works, setup, and what you can expect to hear if you add this to your system. With the increasing diversity of digital sources, we see more and more high frequency noise being injected into our audio systems. This is the problem we set out to tackle with the Digital Director. The foundational first step of the Digital Director began with the Pro USB. This was a proprietary USB to fiber connection that we developed to help isolate computer and server noise, which yielded exceptional results. However, the Pro USB was reliant on the USB power bus and still had more variability from source to source than we would have hoped. We really wanted to explore the potential of an isolated linear power supply, greater processing, and better input management. It was also essential that this would be a field upgradable product that would support existing MSB DACs. At MSB Technology, we are always pushing the envelope forward for what is possible in digital reproduction. The digital director is indeed the next step in that evolution. There were two main categories we wanted to tackle with this project, isolation and processing. The first step was isolation. Isolation is really tricky with high frequency digital noise. Any noise that makes it onto the outgoing signal will continue to be amplified by the system. Even the physical proximity of a digital source coming into the DAC chassis introduced more noise than we would allow. Noise was still being conducted through standard optical isolation circuits as well. Taking things to a new level of performance by removing the input modules from the DAC and isolating them in a separate chassis was essential. This focused the DAC as a core conversion engine free of digital management. There are a few connections between the digital director and the DAC. First, our proprietary Pro ISL connection, which is solely providing the audio path. We also have an optical control link, which is only activated when changing inputs or settings in the digital director. The control link remains off for playback and has no effect on audio performance. Both the Pro ISL and optical control link have lengths of up to greater than 15 meters in length allowing you to move your sources into the back of the room, closer to the listening chair, or even out of the room completely. This allows for complete electrical isolation between sources, conversion, and amplification. The result of this isolation changes everything for source selection. Even with a bit-perfect source, we have still been hearing major differences between one and another. What the digital director sets out to do is level the playing field between these sources. Whether it be an older transport or a modern audio server, the result is giving you the option to choose your source based on your own preferences. With the addition of this input source layer, we were also able to take advantage of increased processing. Two high-powered DSPs were added with the capabilities of up to 12 billion operations per second. These are paired with two dedicated FPGAs for some of the most powerful processing we've ever done. For context, this is up to eight times the processing of our existing DACs. High frequency processing would add more noise into the DAC, but with an isolated chassis, we're able to take advantage of that with no compromises. With all this extra power, we wanted to put it to good use. We started with advanced new digital filters that have been developed over the last few decades. These new filters reveal expanded sound stages greater finesse in complex music pieces, giving you the most natural and realistic performances yet. While these products are designed by theory, we don't really know the results until we press play. When I first listened to the digital director, I was shocked with how much further the soundstage opened up and revealed details that I had never heard before. The boundaries are eliminated and the solidity of voices and instrument placement have to be heard to be believed. I think you'll find yourself listening to your second tier recordings and hearing them come to life with a new relaxed detail that will rival and challenge your best recordings. The Digital Director is offered in three main levels, the Select, Reference, and Premiere. The Premiere is a more compact design featuring a switching power supply. The Reference and Select levels of the Digital Director feature a custom-built, low-noise, linear power supply. Both the Reference and Select Digital Directors feature the same electronics internally, the only difference between them is a chassis design to match their DAC counterpart. The digital director should be viewed as a DAC upgrade. Setup is simple and it can be added to any of our current shipping DACs. When a digital director is added to your system, simply transfer all of your modules over from the DAC to the digital director. Then install the Pro ISL and Control Link module into the DAC.
After your input modules have been moved over, you will need to make the necessary connections of the ProISL cable, optical control link, and the included 12 volt trigger for power control. After a firmware update, you will be able to take full advantage of your digital director. Firmware files and instructions can be found on our website, a link will be provided in the description below. In keeping with MSB design principles, all of the digital directors are manufactured and programmed in-house. The chassis are machined from solid billet aluminum on our 5-axis CNC machines. The circuit boards are manufactured on our in-house SMT line with rigorous quality control inspection for optimum performance. All DSPs, FPGAs, and microcontrollers are programmed from the ground up in-house with custom coding for optimum low noise performance. We are already so excited with the feedback we've received from the prototypes that have been out in the field, and we can't wait for new and existing MSB customers to get their hands on the digital director.